Ready for some hot rods, classic cars, and much more? For the fifth year, the streets of downtown Lawrenceburg will be flooded with cars for the annual Cruisin' to a Cure. Our Raven Richard is out there this morning amongst all the cars and excitement. Uh, I bet it feels great out there right now, and you already have people walking around checking them out, huh, Raven? Yeah, you do. All the hoods are up right now, and these cars go way down the street. I even see, I guess you could consider that a monster truck back there in the background. There's a little Volkswagen as well. So all types of cars out here, some old ones, antiques. But again, it's all for a very good cause. Now, just to give you some background information on this event. So it was started by a Lawrenceburg High School graduate, Logan Lawrence, whose grandfather, Carlos Lawrence, passed away from ALS. Now, ALS is the deadly disease that affects motor skills, and there is no cure for it, uh, which is why all of these cars, motorcycles, and much more will be out here cruising for a cure. Now, there will be cash prizes and awards for the cars that you'll see out here and tons of items up for auction. There's vendors out here, too. And, of course, food, 800 hamburgers and 400 hot dogs. All the proceeds though go directly to the ALS Association. That cruise starts at 9 a.m. in downtown Lawrenceburg. Um, there are several streets that are closed around the area, but you'll be able to see where you can and cannot go and where you park. There's plenty of people out here to help you with that. Uh, Walnut Street, who's the main street that you'll see uh, most of these cars uh, driving on. So again, starts at 9, all for a good cause. Anyone is welcome to come out. Live in Lawrenceburg, Raven Richard, WCPL 9 News.